What's going on guys, Ash King here for another YouTube video. And today I'm going to be telling you how you can repair your stubs on these Traxxas Velocity Heavy Duty Metal Axles. It's the same for the Slash 4x4, Stampede 4x4, and the two Traxxas 2 drive because you use around the same axles, they're the same design for the metal velocity drive shafts. So I'm going to teach you how to repair them. So with the Traxxas Velocity, a big issue is that when you land a jump, or just really hit something, these stubs snap very easily. So basically I'm gonna show you how to make it from like that to like this. So let's get into it. So all you're gonna need for this um, repair is the Traxxas 6753 rear stub axle, the velocity, or if it happened on your front, I'll put the part number which it is for the slash or slash stampede four by four. So I'll put that part number for the front right there. And then you're just going to need your axle, which is broken, and you're going to need, you can use a 1.5 hex, or you can just use a really small screwdriver, or even like, probably a too thick would work, or any sort of pick, which is very small in diameter. So yeah, that's how you, all you're going to need, so let's get into it. For, the first thing you're going to do is just pull this seal back, it's very easy, the seal will just come off. So then, once you get the seal out, this bit. Once you get the seal out of the way, you're just gonna push on this pin. And the pin's just gonna slide out. Make sure you don't drop it or lose it because it's sort of a weird pin size. And once you pull that pin out, which you're gonna have to keep track of, this whole um, part just comes off, so that's gonna, gonna be able to throw that out. And make sure there's a little that little boy. Make sure that um that doesn't, you don't lose that. Okay, once you get it, you're just gonna wanna slide it on like that, and then you're gonna put this pin through the hole. So once you slide in the pin, you're just gonna wanna put the seal back on, and then you're ready to install it back into your car. So yeah, guys, um, these parts are very inexpensive um, compared to the full price of the half shafts. So yeah, if they break every six months, it's not that big of a deal compared to the Eleven dollars you'll spend on seven half shafts every time you break the plastic ones. So these are actually a pretty good investment. Um, but if you want to get good axles, I would definitely either go get my piece or get the XO one axles. I'll leave the link to the Traxxas video on how to put the um, how to install the XO one half shafts on a slash. It's not that hard. But yeah, I definitely not go with these. I definitely get my piece. But if you did already get these and these steps are breaking this is how you put them on so yeah if this video was helpful whatsoever please like subscribe turn bell notifications on see you guys see you in the next one thanks for watching so long, farewell, goodbye. Yeah. Seven days, seven nights.